Thank you for hanging out with me today. This is KG48, and welcome back to Screw Up. Well, I just put up episode one, and it seems most of the people in the comments thought this looks like a pretty interesting game for $1.99. They want to see more, and that's great, because I would love nothing more than to play some more. All right, so what we're going to do today is we're going to continue along the quest line, and the quest line, I must have updated it when I got the flint at some point. I don't remember when it updated, but I needed flint and stone and all that stuff, and it updated. Uh, nothing crazy happened when it updated. It just went to the next quest. So now they want me to craft and place a furnace. Now, I want to move. I don't love where I'm living, and I found a really nice flat area that I want to build at. So we're going to try to build a, a new base today. All right, and we're going to do it right here. I think this area is pretty dope, pretty flat. I'd prefer not to build over trees, but I will if I have to. Um, the, I like this spot because it's kind of close to the mine, and it's also close to, um, I don't know, Sanctuary. I don't even know what it's close to. All I know is it's close to the mine, and what I really love about it is it's a flat area. So this is where I'm going to build. Now, I can't get rid of this bush, unfortunately, and I don't know if trees will grow back through my building. But that's just something we're going to have to find out. All right. Let's go ahead and start placing down some foundations. And I kind of want this to go all the way to the water. The problem is if it goes all the way to the water, it won't be wh where I want it to be up here. Um, I can't see the yellow marker on the right-hand side. Oh, yeah. It's it's um, uh, building uh, change, building height shift, right? Yes. Okay. Great. So that could be... See, the thing is, I'd like it to go to the water, but... Then if it goes to the water, it's going to be too flat on the ground. So I think this is a pretty good spot right here. I think we're going to lower it a little bit. Okay. And I think that looks pretty good to me. All right. So we're going to do a 4x4 four four just to start off with. Come on. Come on, bro. Um, come on. It's a little tricky here. There we go. We'll bring it back a little bit. It's going to be uh, three, uh, four by four. Yeah, it's going to be four deep and four wide. All right, come on. All right, there we go. And I think we can go this way. It's a little tricky, but once you get used to the placement, you know, that's pretty cool. I just don't know if, if like, if trees are going to grow through my buildings, you know? That's the only thing I'm not sure about. Uh, why can't I place that there? I feel like I should be able to place that there. I didn't run out of wood. Did I? I got plenty of wood. That's weird. I won't let me place it there. I'm not really sure what's going on. Come on. Yeah, that's odd. Huh. I, I don't know. Let's try and change its height. See what that does. Nothing. It just won't let me place it there. That is really, really odd. Like, it's not too low. It's not too high. It's just not letting me place it there for some reason okay so i've got something i'm gonna like um i was gonna get a little fancier with it but i think for my first build let's just you know keep it simple stupid and we will you know get fancier with it as we play now i do have this like front uh i don't know what you call it i want to call it dock but it's not i don't know why i'm calling it a dock it's a porch and i'm also probably gonna have a back porch out here although i could make that as part of the building but now nah, i think i'm gonna make that a back porch and I didn't like the fact that it was even numbers because I like to have my door in the middle. Uh, but the thing is, with the door and the window, it kind of it, it's kind of got a little bit of symmetry, uh, symmetry there. Let me go ahead and eat some cookie cocoa nuts. I made some mistakes and I had to break out pieces of foundation, and I don't think you get anything back. By the way, so uh, I don't have a ton of wood, but let's go ahead and build what we can, and then I will gather some more wood. So we're gonna need walls. All right, so a wall there. Doesn't look right. There, that looks right. All right, and then a wall here. That doesn't look right. I think that's it. Yep. All right. Uh, it's going to be pretty... Yeah, yeah, that's fine. Okay, so where's the door going to be to go outside? Just line it up with this door. Actually, I think we should line it up with this window. I think that'll be a nice... nice uh, Difference from the inside part. And then we'll put a window right here to match what we have in the front. Okay. And then I'm thinking a window right here and a window right here. And then the rest will be walls, but I am out of wood. Nom, 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 nom. All right, you know what I forgot to do? Spend my points. I've got like a bunch of like resource points or whatnot. So let's go ahead and spend them now. And then I will continue farming wood. 
All right, so I kind of like intelligence for the ore veins and everything. Um, luck is for critical hit. Uh, affects the chance of critical hit. And then agility is critical damage. Um, I'm not having too much trouble with carry weight, although melee damage would be pretty nice. Um, I'm probably going to spread these out pretty good. Like that. I think I want to go with more crit chance before I start banging up crit damage because crit damage doesn't do anything if you're not critting. All right, so now let's see how fast this cut down a tree. Yeah, a little bit faster, not too much faster. I can only repair this thing uh, like one more full time. I, I repaired this axe I got with the um, repair kits I found, uh, advanced repair kits. I think I can make those. What we need to do is I need to get this thing like set up so I can actually start building inside the base. You know, I have like a gut reaction where I'm like, oh, I got to build a base. Let's build it. Awesome. And just, you know, go crazy. And I'm like, and like, you know, it's not really a good idea to do that in the beginning of a let's play because I'm just trying to learn the game and get things under, you know, just get things going. And I don't need to make some kind of crazy building, but I don't like making square buildings either if I can avoid it. And with these little, you know, um, what do you call it? I forget what they're called. Triangle pieces in the back. You know, it, it kind of gives a little bit of, uh, I don't know, a little bit of angled thing there. Make it look like it's not a completely square building. I mean, making a square building isn't that big of a deal. It's just, if I can avoid it, I will. But then I start saying, oh, I'm going to put this over here. And I'm going to do that over there. And you got to be careful with, um, with like, when I say square, I mean working with a 90 degree angle and you got to be careful when you're not working with a 90 degree angle because you got, you don't know what the roof, what the roofing is going to be like. It, most games like have those angles and they don't even provide the proper roofing to deal with them. So, you know, I'm going to go, I'm going to go a little easy in the beginning and we'll kind of learn. And, um, I'm hoping I'll be playing this game for a while. It seems like it seems really fun so far. I'm having a really good time with it and it seems really deep. I, I can't believe it's a dollar 99. It's just, um, it's kind of amazing. Um, and I'm having a good time with it. So we're going to be crafting and placing a furnace soon here. This is how you repair, by the way. One of these does half um, a repair thing on the hatchet. All right. That'll be enough wood for the time being. Let's come on over here. And let's finish building. All right. So number five. And then we just need walls at this point. Wall wall that's the wrong way no it's not there uh, yeah they're all the right way can i put these no i didn't think so okay all right now we get to deal with the roof but i don't think i want to deal with the roof just yet i think i want to put down some stairs uh like this yep that's it Okay, now I will probably build a slanty roof and just tear it down later because I want it to look cool. Um, but we will have a second floor. I just wanted to put the stairs up there. Just, I don't know, because I could. All right, so let's see how the roof thing works. We got a roof. We got a half roof. And that's it for roof pieces. See what I'm saying? Like, like if you have, like, angles and stuff, like, how are you even going to make this work? Well, I kind of know how I can make it work, but there's no, but if I was going slanty, like if I had slanty sides, this would be a pain in the butt. I can almost guarantee you. All right. We can go with this roof. Uh, no, we're not. We're going to go with this one. And yeah, we're going to go like here, here. Uh, turn around. There we go. Okay, looking good. And then I'm hoping there'll be some kind of triangle blocks I can kind of fill these in with. Um, but let's see if we could do that first. Yeah, yeah, you see these slope walls? That's what we're going to need. But not that one. And not that one. Chopping trees for days. Chopping trees for days. Boom, ba -doom, boom, boom. I'm kind of in a haze. Dude, dude. Um, I don't know. <laughs> I don't have any more rhymes. Okay, so here's the deal, guys. Uh, there's no corner piece, at least as far as I could see, for those half roof pieces, right? These half roof pieces, all right, do not match up with the sloped wall left or right. And I don't see any ones that they do match up with. So I have to use the, the main roof pieces, which, you know, is not too big of a deal. 
But there's also hardcore structure integrity in this game. It's so hardcore, I feel like I'm missing something. All right, and I'm going to show you what I mean in a moment after I'm done chopping down a few more trees. By the way, um, one cool thing is if I leave the game and come back, all the trees are grown back, which is nice. But more importantly, it becomes daytime again, so I can still record for you guys without, like, I don't want to make dark videos, and I can't brighten up these. Why can't I chop this tree? There we go. Oh, that was weird. That was almost like some lag or something. I don't think I'm on a multiplayer server, though, so that was kind of weird. Because you see when I jump, I don't. it pauses the game. So, I don't know. Weird. All right, well, oh, even though I cut out that that tree, it grew back into the building, which kind of is not great, but it's not the end of the world either. All right, well, let me show you what I got going on here. Okay, take this bad boy out. Now, the hardcore, the, 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 the structural integrity is hardcore, majorly hardcore. If you don't have something connected to a wall, you cannot put a roof down, as far as I can tell. Okay, which kind of, which is kind of rough. Also, there's no poles in the game, as far as I can tell. Now, this is a brand new game to me. I could be missing stuff. Maybe I'm gonna look into it in between uh, this and next video, though, because uh, yeah, that seems a little bit a little bit much. So, um, what I had to do in order to be able to complete the roof down here, I had to put two walls here because I can't I cannot get a roof to stay up unless it's connected to a wall. So that's a bit of a bummer, but you know we'll persevere. And there we go. So that's done. Now, these, these roof pieces won't work like this. Well, I guess I could make them work. Because the, the whole thing is with these roof pieces, right? Um, I can't get flat pieces in the middle. And they, they won't go up to a point. Because there's uh, one slope here, one slope here. There's no like way to put it up to a point. So I have to use the flat roof for a point. But you know what I'm going to do? Now that I'm thinking about it. Oh, why did I put stairs? Uh, because I'm eventually going to make this a two-story building. Uh, the stairs are just there just to remember that that's where the stairs are going to be that, that nothing I'm not making the second story right now What I'm going to do is I'm just going to put the I'm going to put the roof up here the way I want it to It'll look cool from the outside. I'll put an extra I'll put an extra wall up here just like I did on the first floor to keep the to keep the thing up because otherwise I don't see any way to do it this, this game's brand new to me and I feel like I'm really missing something because like having structural integrity that severe is really weird like i'm telling you i think i'm missing stuff but i don't know we'll have to we'll have to see how it goes i'm trying to get this to go the right way that's not the way it's supposed to go i can do it from this side see it's not rotating once it's locked in but i could rotate it once it's up there but that doesn't really help <laughs> i mean i guess you won't see the roof but i still want it to go the right way i got most of the building done I just got to put in some doors. I don't know if there's any kind of windows, but I got to put in some doors. And I have to uh, put some railings around it, but it's it's pretty much done. Uh, so I'm just going to come back here and see what I can take with me. Uh, take all. Yeah, we're good with that. And let's see if I can pick stuff up. Like my workbench. Nope. Destroy it. And you don't get anything back for it. Oh, God. Well, I guess there's no point in destroying. What about the bed? Ah, oh, Okay. That sucks. All right, well, it is what it is. Let's go ahead and make another workbench. Do I have 30 wood? I do not, but that's okay. I will work on it. I got to get five cloth as well. There we go. And 30, uh, what, 42 wood? And then we need more wood for that. I got a lot of wood to get. Oh, boy. Well, I left my crafting bench over there and everything. There's no point in tearing it up, you know, when I could just leave it there maybe i could use it if i'm in this area or i don't know whatever if i'm not gonna get anything back for it there's no reason to tear it down so i'm just gathering resources now and let's go ahead oh you can make simple repair kits i didn't know about that what is that oh with iron ore okay i'm not gonna make that right now let's take a look at the workbench and the bed okay so now we're getting back to where we were in the other base and we've got a dope, dope looking little cabin over here. I like it. Oh, I got a lot. I kind of wish I could put a, um, I kind of wish I could put a little, uh, staircase in the back. But, like, like I said, it won't let me. Um, I'm really enjoying this game, but the, the, the little intricacies, the little issues I'm having with the, um, with the building is, uh, I hope they're going to, I hope they're going to look into that stuff. All right. So it's going to be dark AF in here. Um, do I want to make some torches right? I can't make torches until I put the thing down. I, I don't 
think, if I remember correctly. So let's just go in here and put this down. God, I can't see anything. I can't even tell, like... Um, I can't tell what's the front and what's the back. If I had to guess, I would say that's the front. So I guess I'll just put this right here. Yeah, that looks very... That looks like the front. Yeah, okay. Very good. Very good. Now for the bed. I can't get upstairs because of this freaking roof piece, but that's okay. Again, it's eventually going to be a second story thing. I, I That's another thing I would like. I really, really think it's important that you let us move stuff around. Alright, so let's go ahead and put the bed down. And um, this is a good... It's not going to line up perfectly with this place. Oh, God. Okay, forget that. I'll put it like this. Still isn't going to line up. Wow. The bed's not going to line up, but there's nothing I can do about it. Son of a bitch. Oh, man. All right, well, whatever. Let's put the furnace down. And I don't know where I want to put this. I, I kind of want to put it in the front of the window, though. The idea would be that it's, like, kind of... The exhaust will be going out the window. Sure, why not? All right, beautiful. Now what? Now we need to collect stone, fiber, and wood. Um, I don't have stone? How do I not have stone? Did it all go into that thing? Alright, well stone's easy enough. I'm not even gonna go to the mine for that. I took everything out of the chest at my other base, so I have everything on me. I guess I used it all in the forge when I made the, the furnace. And two more. Yeah, stone's everywhere. No big deal. Alright. Craft and place a mortar. M mortar, huh? Um, there we go. And that's something you grind stuff. Advanced stone contraption can be used to grind resources into new substances. Okay, and it's almost done. And there it is. And then we gotta place that down. I need some torches in my house, though. For real. You know what? I'm gonna stop everything I'm doing right now. And I'm just gonna make torches. By the way, um, this, this is another thing I would like to see changed. See how it says palm leaves? I have like a million of them, and they burn fast. I thought I could use those in the torches. You can't. <laughs> you simply can't. So, that's a bit of a bummer. Got the forge started as well. Or the furnace. And it is making me glass, iron, and gold ingots. And I think that's all I can make. So I'm going to go ahead and turn it off. I don't know what I'm going to need any of that stuff for, but we got it. I wish I could do something with those jars. Can't I fill those up with water or something? Nah, I can't even put them in my... I can't even put it in my hopper. Yeah, it's kind of weird. I I'm still not sure how to get water. Like, just water so I can even boil it or something. Yeah. Can't do nothing with that. Alright, fair enough. I also have some torches made up. So let's go inside. And put up a torch or two. And there we go. I'll just put these where I'm going to be, like, working. For the most part. Alright, so I think one right here would be nice. There we go. And probably... How about one right... Um, right here. I guess. Sure, why not? Gotta remember to turn those off when I'm done. Okay, so what next? Oh yeah, we gotta place the mortar. Alright, let's do that. Uh, this thing's tiny. I'll put this over here. Why not? I can't tell. I guess it doesn't really matter. There you go. Um, sulfur. Um, canning salt. Oh, is that for food? Requires crude salt, which I have, and sulfur, which I don't have. Shredded blue flowers. Oh. Max stack. Used in alchemy. Okay, interesting. Sulfur. Um, oh, so flint is sulfur. Okay. Starfish. I don't know what the hell that's for. All used in alchemy. Okay, fair enough. Collect iron ore. Okay, we will go do that. Let's go get into some fights and collect some more iron ore. Now, am I over... Nah, I'm not even close to being encumbered. Although it is nighttime. It is daytime and we are heading back to the mine to get us some iron. Now, I think it's two ingots per, or two ore per ingot. Because I think I had like 16 and I, I ended up with eight iron ore. So, 
Uh, we should be right about where we need to be. So let's run in here, kick some, kick some ass. See what we can find. We just jump over this. Pretty sure I can. Oh, maybe not. Well, it looks like we got an opening over here. Uh, here we go. Ah, damn. It's, it looks like the uh, fence goes up more than it's like showing. You know, like it, it looks like you can get through, but you can't. All right, let's kill some skellies. Level five, my ass. Now, should I just be holding down the button, or... Yeah, let's just hold down the button this time. Nope. Man. Okay, so when you swing the first one, you can hold down the button. Crap, how am I going to get hit points back? I didn't even think about that. Um, oh, the coconuts. Okay. Very good. Give me those hit points. All right? Yeah, there we go. All right. Well, we don't have a lot of coconuts with us. So we got to be somewhat careful down here. Um, see a lot of nodes. Very good. So let's go ahead and get some iron. And then what did we have to get? Uh, 12. So we need another 6. So we need at least 12 ore. I wish there was like some quicker way to pick stuff up. Like hold down the button or something and just suck it on like a freaking vacuum. What is that? Dude, a gold ingot came out of there? That doesn't make much sense. I mean, I'll take it, but... <laughs> oh, dude, we got eight ore out of that one node. Cool. You go away. That's right. These are my freaking ores. Come on. Come on, Papa. So, I'm going to collect uh, stone as well, even though it's going to weigh me down because I'm going to need it to upgrade my base. Um, do I need to upgrade base? Do I need to upgrade base? Do I need to upgrade my base in a single player game uh, where like and people are not going to be attacking it? Eh, maybe not, but I'm going to anyway because it'll be fun. I want to have a stone base. Maybe, maybe it'll even help with the structural integrity issues I'm having. Who knows? Come the pop -up. Give me all that sweet, sweet ore. Damn, it just falls all over the freaking place. Look at it. It's down here. It's down there. You know what? Let's just mine these two. Because they're probably going to fall down as well. So the hell with it. We'll mine all this stuff. Then we'll go down there at the bottom and grab it all. Okay, I am back. And I do have some skill points here. So I'm going to critical damage and base armor. I'm going to put a little bit into this. Give me a little bit more armor. And we'll go another one on intelligence. And we'll go one more on luck. There we go. Okay. Um, so I need to get my iron ingots. By the way, I had I, I needed iron ore. And then I needed iron ingots. So I actually had all the iron ingots I needed. But that's okay. We could always get some more iron ore. Alright, so there we go. And now we have our ingots. Craft, them, craft the metal hatchet. We already had the metal stuff, so... Um, collect six, 60 sand. Okay. Okay. If you, if, uh, do I have 60 sand? No, but I do have some sand. So let's go ahead and grab some more sand. There's my shovel. It doesn't take that long to get sand. That's a spoiled coconut. Just throw that on the floor. Turn off the torches. I'm never going to remember to turn off these torches, guys. I remember today, but never going to happen. <laughs> I'm just telling you right now. So let's go ahead and dig up some sand. So now I can make the iron tools. The thing is, I think the iron tools take less iron to make than the repair kits. Although you do get three things out of the repair kits. The repair kits, you get three of them out. You get three charges out of a repair kit, I guess. And each one does half, so that's one and a half, uh, you know, repairs. One and a half durability of repairs, basically. All right, so let's dig up some more sand. I'm going to have to do the math on that. Because I think I'd rather just make the tools again. Unless there's something I'm missing. Which very well might be the case. Okay, so we should be almost there. I wonder if you keep digging. If you just get more once you actually pick it up. I have no idea. Oh. Would I get stone and something else? Uh, I didn't see the other thing I got. I might have got another crude salt. I actually saw someone asking in, on the uh, forums... Where do I get crude salt? And it was actually something that I knew <laughs> that other people didn't. <laughs> it's crazy. Like, because I don't know jack about this game. A lot I don't know. But I'm learning. 
I am learning. And let's grab that. Oh, we got a gold, uh, a golden plate. That's another thing you do. I don't know if I showed you this, but you, you melt down the golden plates into golden bars. And I'm going to go try and sell one. Actually, I'm going to do that before the end of the video. So let me turn off my timer. Going to go a little long here. There we go. Now what do you want me to do with all that sand? Glass, 20 glass. Sounds good to me. I wonder what I'm going to need glass for. Um, screw it. Let's turn it all into glass. There you go. All right, let's grab the gold bars and let's go to town and see if we can sell these. Because I went to town trying to sell stuff and I could not find a damn thing that they wanted to buy from me. So if they don't want to buy golden bars, then I'm doing something wrong. Um, I was just, you know, with the interface, it's just... I didn't see an option to change to a sale interface. I, I could just click on stuff in my inventory. So I figured that was the way to do it, but I'm not really sure. Let's get, let's get over there and see what's what. This was my starter island. So this is the place that I think I can sell at. We'll just, we'll have to see. Take all this stuff while I'm here. Might as well. Probably going to need it. All right. You going to buy something or what? Okay. So this is the stuff I can buy. Will you buy this? Item is not interesting. Um, yeah, I'm not sure. I'm not sure if I can sell him the iron bar. If he can't, the gold bars. If he can't buy gold bars, I don't know how to do this. Components, equipment, building, fuel, weapons, ammo, tools. See, I don't see any sell option here, but that's what he's got for me to buy. Okay. And then this one over here has some other interesting things. Bunch of bows and guns and stuff, ammo and all that. This one right here. Uh, yeah, I don't think, I don't know if, I don't know how to sell any of them. Anyway, these are all, all kind of melee weapons. It's got some metal tools. All right. And anybody else over here? Oh, open crate. Sure. Ooh, simple repair kit. I guess I should have looted this place. I didn't realize I could, like, loot it, loot it. Um, oh, look at that. Potions. Red drink. Restores health. Oh, cool. All right. Ooh, simple repair kits are only two? Two coins? That's not too bad. Wow, advanced repair kits are only eight? Yeah, that's pretty good. I think those those advanced repair kits cost quite a bit of iron. Yeah, so there's the repair kits I'm looking for. Beautiful. Let me in! I want to loot, damn it. Um, one more right here. Oh yeah, here we go. Definitely should have done this at the beginning of the game, but that's okay. Uh, water, oh, water jar, here we go, instantly, rege oh yeah, that's, that's for water, but that's not really going to help me, because once I use those water jars, they go away, I need stuff I can, like, refill and, like, you know, keep going with. Alright, well, you know what, I do think I am going to call this one here, if you end up enjoying the video, please remember to uncage that like button, also if you're new here, please subscribe for more daily videos, thank you very much for watching, I'll see you next time, and until then, take it easy.